Today we are ripping some 2022 opening day, another 2022 Topps Chrome Platinum. You saw a couple of those yesterday and a bonus pack of 89 Bowman. So you can see this, there's a little bit of damage. The gum is obviously going to be a problem, but everything else looks good. This uh, blaster, not quite the same condition. In fact, one pack I noticed was already open. This is a garage sale find. So we'll go look through that. And then we'll see what else we got in here. So let's see our first open pack. Tim Anderson. Screech. It's kind of neat. Not the same Screech I was thinking of. Josh Hader. And Machado. Centering's really good on that. Look at that. It's really nice. Good job, Tops. Still, we'll put it over there. All right, let me get these out of the way so I don't mess those up. I should have done that already. Mmm. I got excited there, but you also just noticed why I don't really care for these foam packs. They're not as easy to rip open as old school wax. Ruhan, Ernie Clement, Luke Williams, Dallas Garcia, Bryce Harper. Nice. Another Garcia. All right. So we got Retail Blue or some kind of. Refractor with a really nice print line right there, too. Well, that's neat. And then Joe Adele, who we already saw. Moving on. Let's see if we can do this one a little bit better. Nope. Yep. Kyle Hendricks. Not the race car driver, different one. Jake Cousins, Salvador Perez. Cunha Jr. Another mascot card. Mike Yastrzemski, Yastrzemski, got a base hit off of Clay last night, and Clay's uh, first return, but I've been saying it since September, this was going to be the year Clay gets a, a perfect game, I think he's going to do it in the World Series, he's holding out for us, Kyle Muller, rookie card, Lars Newbar, another rookie card, Topps Home Run Challenge, I think we missed the boat on that, but it'll be okay, Juan Soto, Bomb Squad, this is turning out okay, Matt Manning, Zach Wheeler, Nick Horner, Xander Bogarts on the back, Shohei, nice, much better centering on that, I'm not going to wait to sleeve it, Mr. Red, Max Scherzer, and Xander Bogarts. So, so far, more cards in the I like stack than in the discard pile. Not really discard, the nephew pile. But these are still giving me trouble. I'm not a big fan. Maybe that's, maybe that's why this person didn't want to open them. Somebody will take it off our hands. And they were right. Jose Abreu, Aaron Judge, nice. Jackson Coar, Machado Bomb Squad, Anthony Rendon, Antony, Lance Lynn, Carlos Correa. You know what? That whole pack, we're going to. Somebody will take interest in at least most of those, not all of them. Maybe that person's you. Who knows? The link to my eBay store will be down below. If you want to buy multiples, I mean, right now it is for loose raw under 20. It's uh, buy three, get one free. But if you want to do like a bigger deal or throw in some other stuff, I can always cut you a deal, but reach out to me on Kelm.net instead of through eBay because that way we can just do the business elsewhere without... Uh, eBay getting upset at us. Can't skirt their rules. Joey Votto, nice. Alex Bregman. Another uh, mascot. We'll have the whole Byron Buxton. We'll have the whole mascot team soon. Trent Gresham and Teoscar Hernandez. Saw him yesterday in the Chrome Pack, didn't we? Trevor Rogers, Shane McClanahan, Justin Turner, JT. No longer in Los Angeles, but he's still a, an LA guy. That's a cool card. Pretty neat. A little corner damage, so if you are uh, interested in that one, it's not going to gem. Looks like an 8. Tristan McKenzie. Sonny Gray. Haven't heard that name in a while. Emmanuel Kloss. Klaes or Kloss? I've heard people pronounce it both ways. Maybe they're all wrong. Maybe there's a different way to pronounce it. Angels. And not Shohei. Justin Upton now. 
Aaron Ashby. Gilito Bo Bichette. Nice. Oh, a Shohei Bomb Squad. You know what time it is. The Shohei PC is growing daily. So here we got Cattell Marte. Nice. Alex Wells and Justin Upton. Once again, I'm not looking at the screen as I'm going through these. I hope they're not all blurry. Paul Goldschmidt. Doing all right for this 2022 opening day, aren't we? Marcus Stroman. Sammy Long. Kyle Seeger. Opening day for the A's. Max Muncy. That funky Muncy. McCutch. And Goldschmidt. I tell you what. These opening day uh, blasters are pretty, pretty fun to rip open. I have some other stuff. I, I do have a ton of hobby boxes. Like, not modern. I'm not going to be ripping. But, like, old wax boxes and stuff, especially once hockey season comes in. So that's going to be fun. Chris Bryant, teamless. Not even going to try that. Mike Moustakis. What do we have here? Jimenez, Robert, and Abreu. Ryan Mountcastle. Joey Bart. Tyler McGill. You know what? I feel like that's an interesting card. Now, why do they keep the uh, perforations? Well, look at this. All right, so why do they have these perforations? Has anybody ripped these apart? Kind of neat either way. I don't mind smaller cards. I do not like larger oversized cards. I have an oversized uh, Clemente from, I can't remember what, some mall. But it's trimmed in. I mean, I got a killer deal because it's trimmed. I didn't really care about that. But the size is kind of weird. Juan Soto again. Josh Donaldson. Home run challenge. The Pirates mascot. Eli Morgan. Eric Hosmer. Yadier Molina. I, I could get to second on Molina. I think I could. I wouldn't want to, though, because I think he'd be a, a cool guy to, to be friends with. So I wouldn't want to make him feel bad, but I can make it. Cody Bellinger. Jesse Winkler. Jesus Lazardo, Zach Lothar. Ooh, Junior, the kid. Bomb Squad. That would have been great if they lowered him about half an inch so the whole bat was there. Like, we don't need to see his kneecaps, but the top of the bat makes sense. Still, not upset. Raphael Devers. Cody Yay! And Cody Bellinger. Bellinger, as we already saw. His dad hails from Oneonta, New York. In case that ever comes up at Trivia Night. Which is just down the street. I think it's about five miles away from uh, Cooperstown. And Oneonta, last I checked, is the U.S. Soccer Hall of Fame, maybe? Something to do with soccer there. They like to play soccer up in central New York. Starling Marte. Carlos Radon. Joey Gallo. Clark from Chicago. Reese Hopkins. Jack Flaherty. Jonathan India. Keep it moving. I'm trying to think off the top of my head. I don't know the answer, but I wonder how many teams have mascots. Obviously, the Dodgers don't. The Yankees don't. Mr. Met, did they? Yeah, they retired him a while ago, right? So the Mets don't have anybody. Anaheim, I can't remember seeing anybody in Anaheim. Anyway, Emmanuel Rivera, Kyle Schwarber, Zach Short. What do we have here? Seattle. Nice. Alec Bohm, again, we saw him yesterday in the Chrome. I think it was Chrome. No, 2023 Series 1, when we talked about his uh, <laughs> losing his bearing during the National Anthem last week. Corey Kluber and Luis Robert. Who do you think did a better job making an ass of themselves singing the National Anthem? That girl this... Last, what was it, two weeks ago at the All-Star Game, Roseanne Barr back in the 90s, or Carl Lewis? I'll put it on this girl, miles ahead of Carl Lewis or Roseanne. Austin Riley, Patrick Wisdom, All-Star Rookie, Anthony Bender, Matt Olson, Bomb Squad, Adam Wainwright, Marco Gonzalez, and Alex Verdugo. Pretty pumped that I'm over 50% excited about these cards. So what I can glean from that is the harder it is to open the pack, the better time you're going to have once it is open. Take that to the bank. Max Kepler, Will Smith, 
Mookie, Billy the Marlin, Casey Mize, Trey Turner, and Brian Reynolds. Getting low in our opening day stack. I don't even think to check. Oh, all right. So it does say packs with a special insert may contain two to five cards. We haven't seen any of those yet. This seems like it's a seven pack. Fairchild, Ryan Zimmerman, Freddie Freeman, another triple. We got Bo Bichette, Vlad Jr., and Hernandez. Toronto's finest. Brandon Lowe, Dylan Carlson, and Kiebert Ruiz. Ooh. Oh, no. For a second, that one looked like it was thinner, but it feels exactly the same. So, no special inserts, it seems. Oh, talk about special insert. Wander Franco. Not for sale. I did. I'm not going to lie. I sold one of my Wander Francos because it was a Gem Mint 10. And I thought somebody might want it. It went for $6. I paid five for shipping. So I was like, you know what? I threw the rest of them away. But that one in particular, somebody's going to want this. And sure enough, I was right. Willie Mays. Logan Gilbert. You Darvish. Nice. Another one of my PC guys. And Rodolfo Castro. In fact, yeah, let me. Obviously, U is not quite on the same level of PC as Shohei, but he is still one of my favorites. Has been long before he was on the Dodgers, actually. When he first came into the league, the Texas people were talking about him. And then he just happened to come to Los Angeles in 2017. And I was pumped. I'll always have U, U Darvish's back. Tyler Glasnow, nice. My nephew just pulled a Glasnow yesterday from one of those, uh, I'll put a, a picture up on the screen, like one of those Walmart packs, like the $8. He also got a, an auto, nothing that I've ever heard of, the player anyway. And we didn't even bother looking them up. I forgot we got sidetracked. But the point of that story is those boxes are, are actually really fun to rip because you're going to see some stuff you've never seen before. And every once in a while, there, we got a Nolan Ryan and a Jose Canseco. Nothing you're going to retire off of, but very fun to rip, especially for the 6 to $8 you can get them for. Tyler Stevenson, Detroit Tigers opening day. Centian, Corbin Burns, Javi Baez. All right, so we're done with opening day. Let's, we'll leave the Bowman. I think the Bowman's probably going to be fun. That's 89. We might see a Tim Tuffle in there. That'd be near, or maybe a Van Poppel. Absolutely berserk if I get a Van Poppel right now. Reed Detmers on the back. John Gray, Robin Roberts, Vito Bruhan, and Reed Detmers. All right, let's see what we have here. Oh, nice. The glue is nice and dried out. Sid Fernandez. So let's see who got ruined on the front. Oh, good. The, the gum did fall off. It's so disgusting. We used to eat that crap. We did some rips of like, uh, was it 88 tops a couple weeks ago at my buddy's house and the gum in many cases like turned black. I don't know if there was dampness. Oh, Chris Sabo. Oh, that's the messed up card. And he doesn't have his specs on anyway. Milt Thompson. That's another one that got messed up there. Kevin Kaufman. I'm getting better, but these are still, still jacked. Doesn't even look familiar. Bill Bean. Benet. Lance Parrish. Nice. Look how ass these cards are. Like, obviously, the centering is really bad. But even the, the print lineup. This was like CMYK printing or whatever they call that. Like, four-color print, print press. Just disgusting. Lance Parrish, though. Randy Bacchus. It's a nice looking card. It looks like it's from the 60s. Speaking of the 60s, check that out. I guess 50s. Well, into the 60s. Oh, I thought this was a cool insert. <laughs> One of these stupid things. And did you know the card on the other side is a 1951 Bowman replica? I do now. I did before too. True rookie card. Swindell, that's not who I was thinking of. I don't like uh, trying to read their autos when I don't recognize their faces. Mark Lewis. 
Claudel Washington. Weird that for 89, I remember Dave Gallagher, but not seeing was it Bobby Bowman, Brower, and then Sid Fernandez. So all in all, our top 2022 opening day definitely hooked us up the most, but we still got to see Sid, Mick, Randy, and Lance. So all in all, not, not horrible there. Oh, and we got a piece of gum out of it too. But let's just take a quick look once again on the Willie Mays card. Okay, so for our mascots, Billy the Marlin out of Miami, Clark out of Chicago. I can't help but wonder if they named him Clark for Clark W. Griswold. Let's see if it does not mention that on the back. Pirate Parrot out of Pittsburgh, Screech, Washington, Mr. Red, Cincinnati, obviously, Ray, Tampa, and Mascot. I can't, that, that can't really be his name, right? Yeah, apparently it is. So that's the best I could come up with. Not like Elephant or Al Alvin the Elephant. Something, something, anything is better than nothing. So that's fun. Those are fun cards. Let's check out the Penny Sleep Stack. Got Soto. Ken Griffey Jr., Bomb Squad. Shohei, regular opening day. Decent centering. You Darvish, Smoke Show. Perfect centering on that, by the way. Manny, show a bomb squad. Pretty pumped about that. And I'll always say, despite the fact that I'm a Dodger fan and obviously still collecting his cards now, I think Shohei looks better in red. Like maybe it's the cards themselves that make it look that way, but there's just something about that. I think the red pops on a baseball card. Freeman, Mookie, Adolis Garcia. I thought that was numbered for a second. It's just the date. Still, Bryce Harper with the Bomb Squad, Aaron Judge, base opening day, Cunha, base opening day, Willie Mays, Bomb Squad. That's pretty cool. I don't think they count that as an insert, though, since we had a full pack of seven there. So I'm not sure what the deal is. Yachty, Pat Wisdom, and closing it out with Juan Soto. So that's going to do it. In a couple seconds, you're about to see an end card go up that suggests you watch more things. And I also suggest you do that. I appreciate you watching. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about anything you saw today, please drop those down in the comments section. If you're looking for any of these cards, minus, well, minus the Shohei's and the Griffey, uh, you can go to the eBay store. That link will be down below. Most likely by the time you're watching this, these will all be listed. If not, check back the next day. So that's going to do it. I hope you have a great rest of your day. I'll talk at you soon.